Each generation of Americans seeks in growing numbers a college degree. The benefits of a degree are often measured in income potential. In 2005, the U.S. Census Bureau reported that college graduates earn about $51,000 annually. Compare that to a typical wage earner with a high school diploma, he earns just under $28,000 a year. Without his high school diploma, his annual income drops to less than $19,000. At a time when even entry-level jobs often require a bachelor's degree, the value of a college education pays dividends. A college degree makes a real difference in uh, earning income over a lifetime, there's no question about that. Uh, but it does more than that. Uh, it instills a, a love of learning uh, and really prepares students to be strong citizens in their communities. While its value is indisputable, the cost of a college education is also on the rise. In the past five years, the average cost of in-state tuition and fees at public universities have jumped 35 percent after adjusting for inflation, according to the College Board. The primary reason why the cost of college education has increased in recent years is that uh, states have declined uh, in their capacity and, and willingness to support higher education. And so as the proportion of budgets at universities uh, supplied by the state has decreased, tuition has had to increase. Quality, access, value. Colleges and universities are keenly aware of the concerns shared by students and parents who seek a quality education that is also affordable. The University of Texas at Arlington is an outstanding example of an institution actively responding to those concerns. UT Arlington provides multiple avenues of educational access to its students. Its dedication to meet their educational needs is driven by an understanding of the complex economic and civic needs of the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, the state, and the nation. UT Arlington has a number of strengths, uh, but I'd start first and foremost with our faculty. Uh, across a wide range of disciplines, including engineering and science, nursing, many others. Uh, another great asset is our location. We're right in the middle of the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, the fourth largest metropolitan area in the country. By creating a real-world educational environment, rich in diversity of thought, experience, and expertise, UT Arlington can take the lead in addressing areas of national importance. This includes professions such as teaching and nursing, and cutting-edge problem-solving such as national infrastructure, medical and nanotechnologies, international commerce, and environmental sustainability. A real-world education at UT Arlington is active, not passive. Students are involved in hands-on research, service learning, and are engaged on campus. Our faculty ensure that our students are well prepared for the real world. They're, our students are ready to care for patients in acute care settings, and they are able to also incorporate their knowledge and understanding of the lives of patients within a community, uh, their cultural diversity, their background, their needs, as well as ensuring quality of life. Irrespective of how much you read in a book about another culture, there is no substitute for direct interaction. When students from China in the cohort program and our students are paired, they are interacting very closely and in the process they develop a much greater understanding about each other's culture, the way business is run in each other country and they also develop a great deal of mutual respect and appreciation for the differences. At the University of Texas at Arlington we have invested a tremendous amount of effort and time in making the building and the campus more efficient and some of that is kind of low-hanging fruit because there will be a, um, a, a definite payout in the future. But we're very excited that the engineering research complex will be the first building designed from the bottom up to be more efficient. And uh, the building itself, the shape of the building, is designed to mitigate its environmental footprint. So uh, the result of all these efforts will be that uh, w um, many of the lead principles, leadership and energy efficient design from the U.S. Green Building Council will, will be applied to this building from the ground up for the first time. At the University of Texas at Arlington School of Nursing, we have become one of the 20 largest schools of nursing in the country. We have pre-nursing, baccalaureate, masters, and PhD students, as well as serving our community with our continuing nursing education program. Our actual School of Nursing student enrollment now is over 1,200 students. 
business schools to get give full value to students cannot operate as ivory towers. The biggest advantage of the Dallas-Fort Worth area is that this is a major business hub with several Fortune 500 firms headquartered here. In addition to that, it's a travel hub, it's a logistic hub. This gives students exposure in several different ways to the real world of business. Here at UTA, we have installed the first extensive green roof in the Dallas Forward Metroplex. An extensive green roof is different than a, a traditional roof garden in that we only use about four inches of growing media and uh, we are trying to see what kind of plants can survive with a minimal amount of soil, a minimal amount of water, a small amount of fertilizer. So they have to be really tough plants. It's been a tremendous opportunity for the students to actually go up there and install the thing. They moved 30,000 pounds of soil. They've actually taken all the plants up. They planted everything. And uh, it gives them a real sense of being uh, plugged into the environmental initiatives here at the university. Life-enhancing research, teaching excellence, and service to the community are bound together at UT Arlington by a spirit of hard work, innovation, and relevance. This spirit is shared by the institution's 25,000 students at the bachelor's, master's, and doctorate levels, and by over 1,100 exceptional faculty members. Service learning is not for the faint-hearted. Those students who choose to do service learning have to combine the academic learning in a class, in a sterile classroom, and go out into the real world with an agency where they have to interpret and enrich their goals and become teachers and learners with the community. We have currently programs running in three different cities in China, Beijing, Shanghai, and Shenzhen. Uh, this whole concept of a China program very compellingly illustrate the concept of a borderless world. Just as students used to come from other countries to learn here, in this program the faculty from here is going there to teach. This opens the doors for a whole new segment of students to understand the latest concepts and thoughts in the field of management. True to its Be a Maverick spirit, UT Arlington attracts and inspires bright minds and independent thinkers in the classroom, laboratory, workplace, and the community. As a result, in just the last five years, for example, research expenditures have grown 80%, which has led to an exponential growth in invention disclosures, patent applications, and licensing agreements. As a whole, UT Arlington creates a $1.3 billion economic impact on the region annually. In fact, uh, one national employer recently told me that he hires students from all over the country. And from some universities, uh, the students know what questions to ask. But the UT Arlington students he's hired know where to find the answers. For more information about the University of Texas at Arlington, visit uta.edu.